Hi, I'm David. I'm Seely. I'm Haley. I'm Brandy. And we're from Ogallala High School. Ogallala is not a place for poetry. We have one coffee shop that doubles as a Christian bookstore. Half tired teenagers with open stomachs and no Starbucks and more Donald Trump supporters than the nearest asylum. Ogallala is a festering blister, just, just above the butt crack of the panhandle. It is not the home I am familiar with. Raised in the bustle of the California capital, Ogallala is quiet. In a town of drug dealers and accountants, we, we are rebellion. rebellion. We, we are crisscross criss maps of dirt roads and broken dreams. We are teeth and wire twisted around failed marriages and empty bottles. In 2015, we were listed number one on the, the top, top drunkest, drunkest cities, cities in Nebraska. Nebraska. But it is the only home I have ever known. I spent last New Year's Eve in the barn swing dancing. I had my first panic attack in the old middle school locker room. I leave my car on while I run into Safeway to grab a soda. You, you get, get funny, funny looks because you call it soda. Ogallala is not checking the front bolt before you go to sleep. Yucca plants growing up through railroad tracks. The, the resilience, resilience of people with the wild west in their veins. Cowboys masquerading as grocery store checkers. We, we are a town that makes a phrase, pull yourself up by your bootstraps. Literal. Sometimes we are so strong we are beautiful. Sometimes we are so strong we bruise. Sometimes we feel like we are sleepwalking through 18 years of this town. Rumors telling us who we are. Waiting to leave. Waiting to go home. Waiting to come back. Wondering if we ever will. Scared we might have to. But some days I want to stay because... My neighbor mowed my lawn out of kindness. Or made mud pies in the backyard with my sister. Or because, because my, my only neighbors, neighbors are cows and cornfields. Ogallala is beaches and trees not made from concrete or steel. Seeing your teachers Friday night at the only burger restaurant in town. <laughs> or in aisle 7 at Sunmart, where, where you, you know, know the checker by name. name. Ogallala is a lake 10 miles away that starts to call our toes in the springtime. Holding hands under a sky so big, a star so bright, we, we feel small and infinite. infinite. But, but we are flawed. And we have the diversity of the Stormtrooper army before Star Wars Episode 7. And value political correctness about as much as your drunk uncle at Thanksgiving. We are tall grass and summer thunderstorms. 5,000 hearts who beat and beat. And when tragedy strikes, we are lightning in the hills. Can you hear all of our being move? Whatever, whatever we are, whatever, whatever we'll be, Ogallala is now, Ogallala has a voice, Ogallala is here. We are here, ready, ready to be heard. Ready for poetry. <laughs>